guys using keyboard. <clears throat> and this is a loud game. <coughs> Jump, swing. You can. <laughs> so I think we gotta go up. And yeah, apologies for the. Sniffles. Cash? You're kidding. Cash? Money? Dinero? Silver? Gold? Money is the most important thing in the world. With money, you can buy what, anything you want. Hearts, for example. But it seems that during the last quake, I dropped my sack of money. I think I dropped it in this cave here next to us. I can't continue my journey without it. If you can find it for me, I will reward you. You can keep any loose coins I may have dropped along the way. Be careful, young mammal. That cave is dangerous. <laughs> oh, that's a weird, uh... And my baby hat goes through things. Alright. I can hold down jump to jump higher. I don't know, can we pass through this? Yes, we can pass through those thorns without worrying about damage. Alright. Let's grab these coins. We need to be able to buy hats. I say wait for the right timing as I jump at the entirely wrong timing. Just be careful of the spikes. Uh, Alright. We can jump normally with this. Ooh, that was close. Hello, old timer. Thank you, young mammal. That's my sack, alright? Let me see how. Yep, it's all here. I'm not for your reward. Ugh. Thanks, dude. General store in Samora carries just about anything to a boat sale there once, but who would want to do that? Yeah, don't be ridiculous. Uh... <laughs> oh my goodness. Thank you. Bagus is Bagus. While hunting with the Akamara treasure, we have stumbled on what appears to be a seed of insects. The first all the creatures we run across either reacted violently or ran into hiding. However, Gagarin's son, as it may, is able to befriend, befriend a wise looking pillbug wearing a turban. His childlike innocence must have connected with the simple creature. A pillbug led us to the center of the city named Samora, a city teemed with a variety of insects from whom we were able to gather enough information to continue on our quest. We also learned that the residents of Samora have voluntarily cut themselves off from the outside world. They worship Otis, one of the three gods thought to have created the life on this planet. I believe in living a harmonious life where every good action they do brings them closer to perfection. And fear that if people from the outside world were able to come and go, corruption would follow. That explains why our reception was so lukewarm, to say the least. Oh, one more thing. Be cautious if you see any small holes in the walls. They have some nasty mean worms with sharp teeth. Now jump out and attack anyone who gets close. We learn this the hard way. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, oh jeez, okay, I was just gonna go fast. Oh, is that the little bug with the turban? Oh, All right, another save point. Night. Does that restore our health as well? It does. I don't think I can push that when jumping there. 
Welcome to the town some more. I've never heard rumors of Samora City. If we go find this arrow anywhere, it'd be around here. <laughs> this guy's gonna be like, Oh, you remind me of a kid I knew way back when. Hello, friend. Welcome to my humble home. Are you here to seek answers about the old times? No? Well, that's what I do. Would you dep deprive me of my only joy in life? You see, long ago, humans and animals actually lived and worked together. Animals could wield all sorts of elemental magic. And humans had a strong grasp of science and the laws of nature. For a long time they were able to work together, combining science and magic <sighs> to create glorious cities. But groups of humans and animals began to distrust one another. Why? Well, there were many reasons. Regardless of why, wars began to erupt in the world. Peace was eventually gained, but it was too late. The violence and strife had awakened an evil demon who sought the destruction of the world. You probably know the rest. I'm sure you humans haven't completely forgotten your past. <laughs> I'm sure that demon is nowhere to be found. And totally won't be the final boss of the game. Oh, is that a hat, a hat shop? Can we get in? I mean, the hat shop, damn it. Uh, so she has mechanics. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no, I need to find that special panel. Come on. I don't understand until let the bird. Uh, oh, this is probably one that we need to keep pressed. Yep. Let me push this one over this way. But I'm not going. Damn it! I screwed it up. Because we've already learned that we can't push blocks when jumping. And if we go out and come back in, if it's it'll have reset, yes. All right, so we just have to like push it that much. Just give this one a platform to land on, so that we can stand there and push it. Come on, oh, there we go. Yeah, now I can push it all the way over. There we go. Easy peasy. I mean, I don't know what that's done, but... But it's done something, that's for sure. General story out of luck, gets on the other side of this bridge, which is full into disrespect as the ground quakes are already in town. We've evacuated, opted into a rebuild, but he's surrounded by incompetence. We're going to the roach on the other side of the bridge, asking why the repairs are taking so long. Because we can drop down this way, can't we? We just go straight down. I, I missed all the coins, but I got the whatever that thing is. I now have two of them. Two things. 
Mm, this way. Health is a bit pained, but I saw those coins. I saw that coin spawn. Uh. Alright, so the boulders didn't reset. Which is nice, nice to know. that? How do we get there? There's a passageway off to the right down there. Ah, oh, you probably come the other from the other direction. Ugh. Is he fine? Is he okay? Oh, he turned red. Tell me about my brother down there. He's a little slow and he doesn't care much for strangers. You're looking for the general store? You're out of luck. It's on the other side of the broken bridge. I'm trying to get over there too, but the mayor's an old coot who can't seem to get anything done. I don't have time for that. It looks like neither do you. I never think there's another way over here. Just past the gate. If you can figure out how to open it, it'll get us both where we need to go. Alrighty. Uh, Flap, flap, one flap, flap. <laughs> it's nice when I have the rock, I don't get pushed as much. There's another way I could go with a bird to the left, down the bottom. Let's have a look. This way. Oh, I guess we can only crawl through there. But I mean, how would we. Oops. We could just jump down there. Wait, did we go? Oh, we were walking in front of him. Alright. Thank goodness. I can push this out of the way. Hopefully, it'll stay out of the way. Get down here. Temporary coins. <laughs> All right, let's head on through. If you're holding down, down, I guess you could accidentally fall down that way. Alright dude, what's taking so long? I <laughs> hit over the windmill. So we need to find a way to make wind. I believe the general store has been abandoned. I travel days to get here, I want to buy a new stove. By the way, if you notice, if you move an object around, leave it and some come back sometimes and move back to its original position, it's kind of creepy. So that's hinting that this is a puzzle room that screwed up, you can leave and come back. <laughs> so 
And we want to push this boulder to the right and fall down here and then we can push it and push it. This one we want to push to the left and then push and push. And this one... I want to get these coins. I guess we want to push it to the left. Left? No. Yes, we can do that. No. Ah, I'm, I don't give No, that should be fine actually. And then we can hop on it. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Is. Ugh. That's what he's hinting at. Oh well. Let's try again, shall we? There we go. And I'm gonna push this one first just so I don't get crushed. And I just noticed. Yay! Um, excuse you? At least the one on the left stayed where it was. Nice of it. Huzzah! I am gonna... Oh, it's a sale! Sale. Alright, so it's teaching us fire can be used to make steam. I'm sure guys, some of them spew air, some of them fire. I have to pick up oh, natural energy sources. <laughs> oh, jeez. Here, push this down. We can go save. Goodness. <laughs> and in here, we got a sale and compass at last. We should check in with Bagus at the museum. Um, I mean. I don't leave quite yet. Unless we have something else we can do here. Uh, unless there's nothing else we can do here. Maybe that can be something else first. Look at that fire there. Nothing to do with it. Okay. Man, I suck at collecting coins. Alright, let's go see Bagus, shall we? Alright, that's a quick way back up. Let me just jump. Okay. That was now just open the quick way back up and in. Alright, I suck at jumping. Oh, oh. I'm 100% going to die here. Alright, 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 ready? Alright, ready? Huh. Alright. 
Ready for me to hit the wrong button? It's nice that since I haven't played this since I formatted my hard drive and the world map doesn't take five ever to load anymore. Uh, hold on, just so we can save. Let's say hi to Grandma. Hey. Oh. I said hi. Alright, let's go see that old bag, I guess. I guess you all troll it. There's a lot of horizontal distance traveled in this game. At least we travel faster now with the sail. Yeah. Wow, you actually found a compass and sail. That's great. Quick, come inside and come to teach you how to be a great adventurer. Oh, you did. You found a compass and sail. I should never have doubted you. Listen, there's something about the sail I didn't tell you. I've seen it before. It's what original liberty of this island. You see, years ago, my partner, his young son, and I were searching for. How does he not recognize us? It's clearly the container chamber that can grant people immeasurable power. That room is located deep in what is now the basement of this museum. Not really a basement, as much as it is a temple. Built by a self proclaimed wizard who's been dead for centuries. He built it to protect the immense power that he accumulated to defeat an evil demon. He cleverly designed it so that all 12 of his enchanted possessions would be gathered together and brought here in order to gain access to the secret room. My partner, his son, and I gathered all 12 artifacts. We brought them to this island. And we get our way through a treacherous temple and found the room. However, something went wrong. There's no need to go into details, but all I know is that my life was ruined. <laughs> Alright. Uh, important to protect them from those who might try to use them for the wrong reasons. So I brought this museum to house the artifacts and collected them. The problem is too old now. <laughs> First artifact from father for me. Move to the east, first artifact. Thanks, dude. I should probably save after I pick up the map. Uh -huh. Now it's seated. How's it going, dude? In an island, which we can't do anything at yet because we don't have a shovel. Hey, bird. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there's a big tree around. Where the toxic ooze. That's right, we were trying to find you medicine, weren't we? Can you find medicine? said. Uh, same all the patients, same symptoms, there's no cure. Maybe that's really awesome. The only cure is more cowbell. How's it going dude? Ah, oh, what a shame. 
Anyway, I see ya. Does the bird actually land on us? It does, but not when I'm moving. <laughs> ah, new music. Colosial Island. There's the respawn. Yeah. Oh. Put in the quicksand, jump over the crabs. Oh. Can't even jump up there, okay. Or whatever. Alright, see you, Closure Island. You suck. <laughs> I would say it was great, but it really wasn't. Now this one's a bit better. Tenerife Island. Oh, that totally feels like something I can get through. Alright. Do we die in quicksand? No, we just sink. Feels like something we need to push a stone to. Back to the bottom there. Oh, I don't trust I was gonna say, I don't trust that cactus. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we can just get past it, thank goodness. Let's just zoom in, shall we? Did I say better save than sorry? Again, and then yeah. All right, then. sure. Spot. I'm just saying the doors are only open sometimes the day, sneaking during the middle of the night to a full around that was a long time ago. Now it's on cargo ship. <laughs> Get those dance. Ah, oh, save point. Handy. Is it treasure? Treasure hunters, ten years. <laughs> Is that a giant scarab? Red scarab would need something purple. Can we take the. Can we take your radio? Hey, mad scientist. Rock repellent. Uh. No, we don't need it yet. No hunting tips, any treasure hunter knows how to look for signs. We're going for discolorations. Not just shovel. We don't have a shovel. Damn, good, good music. <laughs> I'm going that way. Uh, here's that discoloration. Here's some more discoloration. Uh, hello? 
So there's like an exit more than an entrance. And... Alright, can I grab hold of this? Yes. Okay. So the healing of the temple. And you open it certain times of the day, right? I guess we just have to wait. All right, we're waiting. This is nice. Nice music to keep us company. Alright, night time. Are these doors gonna open or what? 